how's it going? So, um, yeah, so we're going to play more Pokemon Violet. Um, we're going to play more Pokemon Violet, and uh, I just got to turn on a... I just got to tweak something. I just got to tweak a thing for a second. I just got to get the chat loaded. Um, anyway, so hold on a second. I just got to... Anyway, so, um, yeah, we got the chat loaded, so, um, yeah, so we have to leave the, uh, if I remember correctly, you can now move around the school, try checking out on the map where, see if someone else might be hanging around, perhaps you'll discover something, I just gotta turn my headset down. Yeah, I gotta turn my headset down, but, uh, yeah, choose a, let's see, uh, let's go to the staff room. I always forget. I always forget really where to go in this uh, in this uh, area. But um, very well, Champion Neoma. I trust you to handle this in my shed. Good thing you can count on me. In fact, I bet this is gonna be fun. I'm glad to hear it. Good day, then. Anyway, so, um, last time we streamed this, we basically made it all the way to the classroom segment, and I thought I'd just end the stream there. I'm gonna hopefully do the first couple of gyms, but, um, I don't know. This might be a lot of grinding. I don't know what this, uh, is gonna be, but, like, um, I'm kind of making up this stream playthrough as it, as it goes, but, uh, first of all, we just have to get out of the school area, but, um, Anyway, so um, yeah, we got out of the we got to the school area the last time we streamed this, and uh, it took an hour and a half to get to the school area. I feel like I forgot how long this air this game's uh, post this game's like initial area is, but um, the Pokemon Gym locations have been added to your map app. Victory Road, and that's the first achievement. There's three in the game, if I remember correctly. Give us some thought. So, um, we're gonna go. Um, let's go to the cafeteria. We haven't been there yet. But I guess we have to go to him. And um, oh, hey, so we meet again. You remember me, right? Oh, from the lighthouse, yeah, exactly. This, how that, that's my little note, all buddy. You got in mind to steal trap A. No need to tell me your name, all right? So, um, yeah, I'm gonna hopefully we're gonna do a little bit of grinding because, um, that's one problem I do have with Scarlet and Violet. It's kind of grind heavy, let's just say. I'm just gonna go to an area. If I remember correctly, there's also a separate way we can grind Pokemon that doesn't involve constant battling, but, um, So this is the Titan side quest, which is um, the Path of Legend. That's the second main quest in the game. There's three of them. So um, anyway, so we should be able to leave here now, but um. We got, a, we got a phone call, but, um... Yes, the t this is going to demonstrate the Team Star quest, which uh, that's the third quest we have to do in the game. This game has, like, three whole quests, but, um...
Anyway, so that's the te that starts the team star objective, I think, or does it? I don't know. I guess we can, um, we got our... I like that tone, by the way. I guess we're getting called to the director's office. I have to remember where that is, though. I think it's, uh... I don't remember where the director's office is, though, but, um... To be honest, I might remember- I kind of remember fuck all- I might remember fuck all about this game, but yeah, there's the director's office. Thank you for coming, Master Bear, and uh, have you been enjoying your time? You, you have a yes. That's the most wonderful to hear. Made me wonder why we cannot simply con converse early in the cafeteria. Let me assure you, there's a reason I asked you to meet you here in my office. Seems that a friend of mine is rather serious matter where they would like to discuss with you. And no, I'm afraid they are they aren't actually here in this room with us. One moment, please. Just allow me to correct us. Anyway, so um There's uh, the Pokemon I keep forgetting his name, but uh, yeah, the last couple of generations, like the last three generations, I at least have a I have a hard time for now, like with some of the Pokemon names. Like I know I played Gen Eight and I played Gen Eight when it was new and uh, wasn't huge on it, but I I wasn't huge on Generation Seven as I found those games to be pretty boring, but um. Yeah, I think we can leave the school now, but I have to double check. Hold on. We need another scene, but, um... I guess we have to go to the dorms then, but, um... Yeah, I always forget how long-winded this game's intro is. See you tomorrow when you rest up, then we can battle even more, and, uh... I guess we can, uh, take a rest if it means we can advance in the story, but, uh... Yeah, I have not played this game since it was new, so, um... There we are. It's quickly five by if you start your new life at Uva Academy. When the last day arrives, your true adventure begin. Attention all students, same marks the beginning of an important new assignment. Please examine the schoolyard while explain more details. So we have to go to the schoolyard now. 
Hold on. It's time. We wait forever for this. Come on, let's go out in the schoolyard. So uh, yeah, we're going with her. You wanna go uh, schoolyard? Excellent, it seems everyone is here. Well, that's time I explain your independent study assignment. As usual, the theme will be a treasure hunt. Ask each you to set out and travel the world and search for your own treasure. You all have learned within the walls of our fine academy. Now it's time to turn your eyes upon the wide world and deepen your understanding. I can see some laggy sprites, by the way. These ones are just not moving. It's just like non motion sprites. And find something you might always treasure. I look forward to welcoming you all back after. Yeah, these, these look at the look at the girl in the background. Like she she's kind of moving. Her movement's kind of like a little aw, iffy. If I can point out all the the laggy sprites in this game, we'll be here all day. So um. Oh, yeah, it's time for the great outdoors. So, um, now I remember since last stream, this is also, I think, if you press the R button, you can like send out your front Pokemon, like, they can just ki instantly kill wild Pokemon. I guess that's a really good way to grind, also. I think we might go grind in that way. No, I'm searching for wait, that's not the right sprite. You were a different sprite. Anyway, so, um, the treasure hunt is finally starting, and, um, yeah, fair question. She, since your first time coming, let's walk and talk. Treasure is a huge part of the Yuva Academy school year. The points to get all guess looking for some actual hidden treasure necessarily. We've got more just making our own venture to see what experience police got to offer. If you could try to beat Pokemon gyms, you could help out people in need if you can hunt for real capture, capital T treasure if you want it even. There's stuff we never learn seeing in a classroom, you know, it's a chance to learn it. I knew phone mess less at destinations, but this is kind of a tutorial sequence. Sorry, I'm just adjusting a few things. Um, anyway, so this this uh, this basically starts this Team Star quest. So um,
And finally, our adventure is about to start. We've only been streaming this for 20 minutes, and not only that, we did a whole hour and a half stream the other day, but, um... And we can ride on him finally. That's not legit. My favorite thing about this game is riding on the is riding on the Pokemon. Like, um, it lets us go really fast. But um, now I just for I don't. The reason I'm probably gonna grind out some of the earlier portions of this game is I honestly forget what tier order they uh, we have to do a lot of these quests in, but um, cause like they don't grow up with different, they don't go up as with like progression like most open world games. So uh, basically uh, it was our next destination. Um, go. Well, I want to go to the uh. I have to find on the map for a second, but, um, it's not there. Um, lighting and, uh, that's grass. I think bug type is the first gym, first gym the game designers intend you to do. Yeah, it's this one. we are set that as a destination and we'll be on our way. So, uh, You can also jump with the uh, Pokemon. It's a, uh, it's an interesting mechanic, I guess. I really like the greatest, but like, um, it's just having the bicycle in the older games, like for the whole game, basically. So yeah, I forgot. I just remember this. If you press the R button, basically, um, if you press the R button, basically, you can send your Pokemon out and just kill wild Pokemon. We might start doing that. Let's uh, go out. Now, I want to level up some of the... I want to level up my Fletchlings. So, I think what I'm going to do is... Uh, I'm just going to hunt down wild Pokemon to kill. So, um, I don't think the Fletchling is going to be a permanent team member, though. I want, like, a Corviknight on my team... On my final team. Let's see if we can find some wild Pokemon. That. Boxy wore itself out and came back to you. Oh. Well, I guess we can catch a Marie, but um, maybe I should not do that method until I'm a higher level. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna switch out to the Diglett. And it does not affect us, so because I had a feeling I was going to use something like that, so um, yeah, we'll just use Scratch. But I don't think we're at the point where you just casually kill Pokemon like these. Like, maybe we could in the earlier routes. I don't know. Affect Diglett. One more hit and we'll catch it. And of course, doesn't affect Diglett. We have 21 of these Pokeballs, so we can afford one of them failing. Diglett grew to level nine and um, We're not gonna, I don't think we want it. I don't think I want them reaping our boxes. So, um, it's a good special attacker, but it's slow. So, um, so 
Go see if we can do it this method. Good. That's that's a problem, but uh the potions on this thing. Yeah, I'm not at the level where I can just like casually just do that method. But, um I guess we can switch out to a fletchling and uh maybe we can do it that way. Yeah, we're, there we go. So fun. Where's the flesh thing? There it is. Kill this, um... Still trying to get used to this mechanic as to while I've done it, but um Alright, Fletchling's level 10 and uh what did Fletchling learn? Okay, learn quick attack. We're just gonna, we're just gonna keep killing some hop ip. Sorry this seems boring, but I want to get up a few levels. Quax is level 13. Maybe don't put a fletchling against a Mareep though, but um... Is there any more hop up left to kill? There, there's a hop up. This thing was so fat came back to you, but um, where was where did that hop up go? Where'd it go? I saw. I thought I saw a hop up. Of course, I like these a potion, but um. Oh, uh, this could be bad. I'm gonna run away. <laughs> Heck. I guess maybe let's catch this thing. Level 11. Healy buffs level 10. Fight this hop up. Well, I guess we're finding it normally. Yeah, I'm still not used to this mechanic, but um. Yeah, don't put a Quaxly up against a hop up. I guess we'll go back to find this normally. I don't. I forget how to send Pokemon back though. That's, that loads the map. So um. We got Chesto Berry.
You know, I want to get that thing down there. So, um, I want to get that crystal thing down there. So, um, so there's a move I want to get down there. And it's low kick. Not a bad move. Okay, I can't go down there that way. I'm really just looking for Pokemon to kill so I can get my Pokemon's levels up higher because I can't exactly remember what the first gym's level set is. Okay, let's just get our let's just get our Pokemon. Diglett's level 10. I guess we can go down that way, but um or well, I could I could use killing I could use catching or killing that. What level's this? It's uh Oh, level 25. We'll get a ton of XP for this though. Yeah, it's gonna heal itself. You know what? We can do this. Let's try to see if we can kill this thing. Oh shit. Don't have to use something different. Uh Try flying, so let's try paw me. Taco sharply, but we're confused. Yeah, I do not have good confusion luck, let's just say, but uh, let's just use a thunder shock. Yeah, it's gonna use roost. Yeah, let's just run away. And get away, fuck. Yeah, this thing might obliterate our whole team. All right, we got away at least. Oh, we have to go to the Pokemon Center. It's down there. Yeah, that's one thing I don't like about this game is that the levels are pretty inconsistent. One area you're fighting like level 25 Pokemon, the other area you're fighting like level five. Um. All right, we're gonna get some good XP out of this. All right, they're running away, so um. Let's just heal our palmy that got knocked out, but um, I guess that's a good grinding spot except for the level 25 Viva Queen. I 
I'll find more. I want to see if I can find more grass types like that. All right, Fletchling's level 12. Or Pommy's level 10. Not getting in that battle again. I want to fight a Marie, but, um, pop up. Let's try to see also if we can, uh, see if we can get like an XP candy out of like, uh, one of those things over there, down there. And then we'll go to the bug type gym. challenge the group um oh pokemon that is she's our highest level anyway so they brought these things back from jenna these giant pokemon battles So let's try actually I think it's ice is that thing ice type that is an ice type so uh, let's try wing attack And we're burned that lowers our attack in half Yeah, it looks like we're gonna kill this thing. Is it because of that down there below the life mirror is the time limit? I remember that at least from both Gen 8 and this. Your wing attack was disabled. Our water gun. Yeah, you don't want to faint in these battles because, yeah, it'll be five seconds until revival. That just wastes time that you don't have. And let's see if we can catch this thing. All right, let's see if we can catch this thing. Catch this thing. There we go. We got an XP candy extra small and XP candy small. So that's solid for this part of the game. I guess we can use them on our. We use the XP candy extra small on our Squaxly and the small on our. Uh, mommy. We got a fire type, so uh let's put it in our party, actually. Um I guess we can swap out the uh Iggly buff. I guess we can swap out the Diglet for it. And 
This thing's level 12, so pretty solid for this part of the game. Um, we got two XP candy extra smalls when you use those on Quaxley. Level 14, and let's use the XP candy small on uh, level 12. And uh, the nuzzle is. Can I save the target? Eh. I guess we can get rid of charge and replace it with that. And are we at a, let's see, let's get a couple more levels in and then we'll go to the gym. First we're gonna go to the Pokemon Center. Um, I want to see if we can find more Pokemon out in like South Providence area too. I want to say the further north you go, the more higher level Pokemon you find. But uh, I guess we can kind of take a gamble, like go for some high level Pokemon and like, um, cause we'll get a fuck ton of XP. So see if we can get a level up out of this. Right, fetchling, I want my fetchling to go up at least two more levels. Fetchling's level 13, and uh, I think what level fetchling evolves though. It's either 16 or 18, I forget which though. Get these, let's get these Pokemon. We're just gonna get these Pokemon up a few more levels. Um, all right, hold on a second. Uh, let's see. Um, See if we can get a, uh, also sorry for that. And there's, there's a Pokemon Glower down there, but, um, yeah, let me just, uh, check the map really quickly. The, um, Yeah, I guess, um, I guess we can find some Pokemon a little further north, even though they're going to be more higher level, but, uh, let's try it, actually. Let's try to go farther north, because it's essentially high risk, high reward, if we can, if we can do, like, uh, Get some more higher level Pokemon. Not that Marape. I guess we can kill a Fampy with the Quaxley. What level is this Fampy? Because I remember the Pokemon here a little farther north uh, are higher in level. Level 15 Fampy, so uh, we'll get a lot of XP out of this. And we gotta, we gotta also take him out for the rollout combo. Alright, we're gonna catch this thing now. Oh fuck. Yeah, we better catch this thing. <laughs> oh 
Oh, fuck, no! Oh, thank God it missed. I think we are faster in this thing, so let's just kill it. We're a ton of XP. Oh, 15, yeah. I think we found the sweet, I think we found a sweet spot. Let's put our uh, fetchling against the Mankey. Wait, did the Mankey go away? There's the Mankey. Yeah, this thing's level 15, so again, we can get a lot of XP. Fourteen and English buff wants to learn disarming voice. So I guess we can teach her that. Uh, can we teach her that? Uh, yeah, let's teach her that. And let's get rid of copycat. Yeah, let's. Uh, what, what level is this? Um. Okay, only level eight. I want to find. I want, I want to find out what level this thing is. I might even catch it. Level fifteen. A level fifteen skidoo. You know, we're we're definitely gonna try to catch this thing. Not very effective. Thank God it's not doing very much damage, but um. All right, let's try to see if we can catch this thing. And we caught it, yes. Well, that's until 15 and learn flail. We're still gonna put this thing in our party. Don't wanna give it a nickname, but we're gonna put it in our party. Uh, we're gonna, I guess that's goodbye to, I guess that's goodbye to Magikarp. I see. Of 11, so. Yeah, this thing's just gonna spam growl, so, um. Oh shit. Check it out, thankfully. 13 and uh. Check out our Quaxley and uh. Alright, um. Try a Fampy again. Let's try the Fampy again. This one's level 13. In Fampy Fainting, it's gonna get a lot of XP. I'm hoping we can get a, an, an evolution out of this. Uh, there's a Mistrevis, but um, yeah, let's, let's go up against a Mistrevis. Not a 
fantastic ghost type, but it's uh, it'll be a nice XP. We'll get some nice XP out of this. Now, if we get confused, we won't. Yep, that's my confusion lock in a nutshell. Are you gonna, is the only thing I know is confuse, Ray? Two times in a row, are you serious? I want to lay down a goddamn hit on this thing. I'm using a potion. Almost out of them, though. And, uh, let's see. Not many other attacks work. We have to rely on water gun. And, of course, we flinched. Outside of its confusion, thank God. Didn't even do that much damage. So, um, yeah, we're just gonna run away. No, nah, I am not fighting this thing. Back to the Pokemon Center and uh, heal, and then we'll uh, do some more grinding. So I'm gonna grind a little bit and then do the first gym and then I'll go on an intermission and then um, we'll pick this game back up. I wanna see what else we can find. Um, I'll, you know what, that, um, that one up, that little place up there is tempting, so we're gonna go there. But yeah, the, I think the farther north you go, the more higher level Pokemon you're gonna find. Actually, we, can we even reach that? I think we can. We just need a nice little jump like this. There we go. So that's a dragon, that's a water flying type of thing, or is it, it's a dragon flying type. So uh, I guess we're gonna change to Change out to Palmy. Not mean to exit out of that, but uh, yeah, we're gonna switch to Palmy and uh, select it and uh, challenge the group. I think if you, I don't know if you, I think. Uh, yeah, I think this just searches for players, but uh, if you hit all ready to go right away, like, uh, I'm trying to see if it searches for any, like, players or anything. Just hit all ready to go. Start raid battle. Help us arrive, you have full party raid with. Yeah, this thing I think is dragon flying, so it's either water flying or dragon flying. I don't know. I'm not the most familiar with Gen 3, so.
Yeah, it's super effective. So, um, we're gonna take this thing out. We, I'm hoping we get a ton of XP out of this. It's level as I might also might use it on my team. I don't know. All right, we we took it out, so we're gonna hopefully catch this thing. If we can catch this thing, I might make it on my team. I don't know. It's a. It, I think it evolves into a pretty solid Pokemon. Alright, we caught it. So Swablu is caught. Got uh two XP candy small, three XP candy extra smalls, and two XP candy smalls. We got a little bit of stuff out of that, so. Yeah, it's a normal flying that evolves into a dragon flying, so, um... Get rid of, um... What level is it? Let's get rid of Igly buff so I can see what level it is. Level 12, so, uh, we'll keep it for now. Start to see what we can do with this uh, with our XP small. So um, we have four XP candies, extra small. So let's just use two of them and and we're evolving. Waxley's evolving. Waxley evolved into Quaxwell, the water type. Use, let's use our remaining two extra candy extra smalls on uh this thing's level Pommy's level 15 and wants to learn dig. We'll teach it dig. We'll get rid of scratch and replace it with dig. I don't want to go to more of these to be honest. Because if we can get to like level 20, we'll like flat out obliterate the first gem. So the Pokemon is, it's a, uh, oh, this is actually another water type. So we're going to have to spam wing attack on this thing. It's a Choodle. Also, I forgot, part rock type. Yeah, this thing might be a little bit of a pain to take out. As long as we can do it within the time limit, we'll get the highest reward. It's already, it's already halfway down, so, um... We're already almost dead, so as long as we can beam in the time limit. And he's down, so we're gonna catch this thing. Catch and catch it. 
Maybe I would use the premiere. Maybe I'll use the premiere ball the next one for shits and giggles. Maybe not. And we got it. We got Choodle. We got, uh, okay, 2XP Candy Smalls and 2XP Candy Extra Smalls. Gonna put this in our party though. We already have a water type. And uh let's see what we can do with our XP candy extras. And flexing's evolving, so I think I guess we can go to the gym now. Fletching involves in a Fletchlinder, Fletchlinder, so uh, it's a fire flying, so uh, yeah, we'll, we're gonna go to the bug type gym later now. Flame charge, we'll teach him that. You don't need growl anymore. Yeah, we'll go, we'll go to the gym later. I think we're in a good enough position to take on the uh, gym. Now, uh, I've noticed this area, ha I remember this area has some pretty laggy sprites, particularly with like some floors and stuff like that. First of all, we have to find, where's the Pokemon? Okay, the Pokemon Star is down there. We uh, got our Pokemon healed up, so, um, righty, so, guess what we can do now is basically just, uh, go to the gym and, um, Now, this is the part with the, oh, uh, yeah, some laggy sprites right there. Look at this kid. Yeah, it's... Alright, so, um, yeah, the thing I remember about this gen, I think, I think it was also, like, it, it's mainly, the thing I remember about Scarlet and Violet is basically, um, you have to take a test before going to the gyms, before facing the gym later, so, um, yeah, we got some super potions also. Yeah, so I'll beat this first gym, and, uh, I'll go on intermission, and then basically we'll look at something, like, maybe take out a Titan or something, I don't know, like, um, I might have to, while I'm, inter I'm on intermission, I might have to look up what order these game designers intend to these, do these things in. So take part in the Olive Royal. All right, so where's that on the map? Um, over there. So, um, yeah, this might not be the part with the sun floor. I was thinking, of. I might be thinking of the grass type gym later.
Okay, where, um... I go here. Get the balls on the obstacles, so, um... Two, one. All right. Um, yeah, we just, I don't think, I don't remember this thing being that hard. We just have to get it in the uh, basket. Hey, okay. throw it like this. No. Come on. Rolling, 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 rolling. No. Not rolling. No, no, that's backtracking. No, no, I want to get it in the damn basket. I don't think you go that way. I think you have to go around like this. We'll do the gym battle and we'll go on intermission. That performance, I'm sure we look forward to a great all house next year. All right, we passed the gym test. Report of the gym staffer. Talk to him. Welcome back. I you heard you were roll out there. A big crowd is going to be playing the gym test. So, uh, yeah, we're going to do the gym battle. We're going to intermission. Thank you very much for your skill for all of our own. It's pretty impressive. If I get into it, forgive me. My name's Katie. I'm the owner here at, uh, yeah, this is the gym leader. So, um, did I put a flesh flesh line on the part, the front of the party? I better have. Jim Lee or Katie, so eh, eh, bug steel type. Uh, I think that's a bug steel type. So it'll, it'll have a time for resistant to fire if I'm right and this is a bug steel type. Yeah, I'm right. Also our speed rises. That's my that's the thing I, one of the things I like best about Fletchling as a Pokemon. We might be able to clean sweep our team, come to think of it. 
Because look at our Pokemon's level. They're like level 14. We're going to clean sweep our team. Alright, uh, Teddy Ursa. I don't remember Teddy Ursa being a bug type, though. <laughs> Sometimes they put in like Pokemon like these and like they they're like crystal forms or like bug types whatever reason Because I don't remember Teddy also being a bug type so And this is their highest level we're still three high, we're still three levels ahead so um Flame charge, and we're gonna oh, not take it a one hit, unfortunately. But our speed will be, uh, yeah, fury swipes. It's not gonna do much. We've got this fight in the bag. We still didn't get a level up, unfortunately, but we we beat the first gym leader, so um I guess that's an appropriate time to go on an intermission, so I'll and after the intermission I'll try to tackle other things like Titans and maybe the second gym, I don't know, but um Yeah, we got the first gym badge. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go on a, I'm gonna go on a little bit of an intermission. So, uh, it'll be like maybe 10 minutes, maybe 20 minutes. It might be a little longer because I have to, I have some stuff to take care of. So, um, I'll be after this uh, phone call, I'll go on uh, intermission. But uh, I think uh, I'll go on a little break. It might, be, it's not gonna be any more than like maybe 20 minutes, but like. Uh, Either way, I'll see you guys momentarily.
Alrighty, so we are back with more uh, Pokemon Violet, and uh, if you're new to the stream, as I see people coming to the stream, so uh, we got to the bug type team. We raised our Pokemon in some of the in one of the with more stronger Pokemon that we fought. So um, yeah, we're gonna try to see if we can. Uh, we're gonna try to see if we can either get the second gym badge or do the first Titan. I don't remember which order you have to do it in, but like um, I didn't get through, I didn't really do a deep dive in a while, Pokemon Violet, but. Um, Plus, the last time I played this game was when it was brand new, but, um, this will essentially be my second time beating it, so, uh, yeah, we're just gonna go to the Pokemon Star. I wanna try to see if I can find that, like, that honeycomb, that, uh, again, and, like, try to see if we can, like, like, maybe kill it this time. Did you know, uh, yeah, it's basically telling us that, uh, we can he he get the orb healed by, uh, our charge by going back to the Pokemon Center, but, uh, we find that, uh, hey, sometimes uh, no one always remember what Combi evolves into, but can we kill that thing this time because we're much higher leveled, uh, I don't know. I don't see one now. You know what, since we have Pokemon evolved, let's go farther north and try to raise a few levels. Like, um, I think I found a sweet spot for grinding for this part of the game. But, uh... I'm trying to remember where it is on the map, but, uh... Where's the map? Where is it on the map? It's, uh... Yeah, it's around here, so um It's up that path that never mind. But um yeah, we did earlier in the stream we found a sweet spot for grinding. So yeah, that is a sweet spot. The sweet spot for Grind I found was uh, the root up above this one. And we have some of all Pokemon, so we'll be able to take out some some more Pokemon with this. Um, take out, let's try a Mankey again. Yeah, level 15, so let's get up a few levels. Like we almost one shot this thing. Not very effective. And it's burned, so, uh, n yeah, nice. I would have hoped the burn damage would have killed him, but, uh, unfortunately, no. Well, another Mankey. Let's see if I can, like, take out my Pokemon and, uh... I'm not meaning his flame charge, but um, I guess it's still the same type of attack bonus move, but so is Peck, though. Yeah, use Peck. Yeah, we're gonna take, we're just gonna take it, we're gonna take it using using Arbor and see if we can blaze it and get some quick XP. See if we can get some quick XP with this. Yeah, we're getting some quick XP. And, hold on. And we're, getting some, we're getting some really quick XP, come to think of it. I like this. But, um... Okay, yeah, that's a new Pokemon. Well, it's a new Pokemon in our playthrough, but, um... Some reason I could tell it was a grass type. Where we see um see the cause worth yeah, I don't want that. I I don't know what Pokemon are do and don't have the insomnia ability.
Yeah, we found a sweet spot for grinding. Bob was level 13, so, um... I don't want to see if I can get greedy. I might not try to see if I can get greedy and go farther north, but, um... Hold on. First of all, we have to find where to go. Um... Let's see, um... Ground Titan, um... I can't remember what Titan the game is. Titan or, uh... Steel Titan, I think, is later, so, um... Let's go to the ground, Titan. Like I said, I didn't really do too much of a deep dive into Pokemon uh, Scarlet and Violet, but uh, and I've only played, the, I've only beaten this once, so uh, yeah, we're gonna have, I'm going in this pretty much partially blind. We got a Great Ball, which is nice. Um, we gotta take a couple, we gotta cross a couple of bridges. Hey, a Psyduck, um... Take out Palmy and fight it. Is this one a higher level than the other ones were? Level 17, yes. Let's let's get some nice XP. Yeah, free or swipes ain't gonna do much. I say as it took half our health. Come on, don't hit more than twice. Oh! Okay, right, three times. We're getting a lot of XP out of this. He's a super potion, unfortunately. Let's uh, go to the Pokemon Center. I think um, it's up there where the Earth Titan is. That's yeah, up there. All right, so um, try to see our phone ring. Yeah, let's uh, let's get our flip center back and uh. So that didn't give us much XP though. Um, flame charge. Not very effective. Um, this is not rock type. Oh fuck. Yeah, we're ran we're running away from this thing. Yeah, we're not fighting that it is a fire flying type. It's like it's like putting a Charizard up against an Onyx. Like it just doesn't really work. We're 
run we're running away from this thing once again. Did we get Quackle? No, I don't want to fight you. Hey, a manky. Let's just uh, let's just one shot this thing. It's level sixteen. One more manky fight, and it'll be level uh, eight. It, my quacks will be level eighteen. So um. Box is level 18, so, um... I've used the wrong move by mistake. There's our speed rose out of that, but uh, we're already faster in this thing. Yay, it missed. So we have to go kind of up this hill. We're going to get our first Titan. So um, I guess we can get the Titan and then go to the second gym, which I think is the grass type. So avoid the boulders. Now every time you defeat a Titan, you learn a new move. So with the Pokemon, so um. Anyway, so, um, it's a Sky Titan, so it's, um... Yeah, I think I went to the wrong Titan. I meant to go to the ground one, but I think I went to the wrong Titan. I have some revives in case I faint. All right, so um, let's burn so it'll lower its attacks out in half. So, um, Now, let's try to see, um, see if we can use Palmy. Not very effective, and, um, Thundershock. All right, there we go. One more hit, and he'll be dead. Super effective. Did 
Not even bowl of beers if you began eating something. I forgot you have to fight these things twice. We're just gonna use a uh, Swablu as a sacrifice Pokemon. We can get um. Again, I am doing things a little out of sequence, so um. We're just gonna try to see what we can do before I lay down Thunder Shock him. And yeah, it didn't attack us. So um yeah. So uh we just have to hope we don't get hit Thunder Shock from the death. Right there we go, there we go. Damn it, I can't use the same move twice. All right, there we go, there we go. And a critical hit also, that's amazing. And fainted, yes. Mommy's evolving. Mommy evolving to Pomo. Electric fighting type. Arm thrust. Um, you know, let's get rid of, I think we're good with what we have. Anyway, so after this dialogue ends, I think I'm going to end the stream. Great. It was a great stream, so I appreciate everyone that's uh, come out to the stream. So, um, you're just going to see this cutscene first. So uh, we got a Titan badge. Yeah, so I appreciate everyone's coming to the stream. So, um, unfortunately, though, we're going to end the stream. So, um, well, after this uh, sandwich cutscene comes, uh, we're going to end the stream. Unfortunately, I appreciate everyone's coming up to the stream. 
And uh, I, apo I also apologize for those that, that are kind of newbie boom I got from the last portion of the stream. But uh, we've had fantastic attendance on the stream, and I cannot thank you guys enough. And